Hello, I'm Luke, and welcome to the Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs Rebuild... Oh, wait, no, it's already taken. The rebuild's taken. Hi, I'm Luke, and welcome to Let's Make the Bulldogs Great Again... Oh, no, that's already taken. Is there any other titles that haven't been done for Rebel League Life for? Hi, I'm Luke, and welcome to Let's Win a Game on Career Mode. So this is episode 6 of the Canary Bank Sun Bulldogs career mode on Rugby League Live 4. And so far, we haven't won a game in the 13 side game. I'm not even counting the 9s. Who gives a shit about the 9s? We haven't won a game, and I've been super frustrated. I had a little bit of a break, and I'm ready to go for this game. Okay, so the first game of this episode is taking on the New Zealand Warriors, and their team is on the screen at the moment there. You can see it's pretty standard stuff for them. Got to watch out for the halves. Thankfully, on this game, halves and stuff aren't that, too, that big of a problem, and their rating for this game is actually... Like, one of the worst um, in the NRL. I think only the Knights is kind of worse than them. Um, so, our team on paper is a lot better. And our team is on the screen right now. You can see it's actually unchanged from the last game. I'm still debating. Still debating. I have recorded this before I can see your comments. But I'm debating on swapping the team around a little bit. I did really consider moving Brett Morris to fullback. But I thought he'd probably be more effective on the wing anyways. Considering the fullback is just useless on this game. Alright, here we go. B-Moz. B-Moz into the gap. B-Moz. Oh, he's through. B-Moz up against Tuvasa Shek. Of course, he's not going to beat Tuvasa Shek. Probably got the pace in him as well. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And he's just grubbing in for himself. I don't know why the hell he just grubbed there. And it literally went like one centimeter. And they've actually scored because we got locked in. Both the Morris boys got stepped by Tuvasa Shek. Which is, I suppose it's not realistic. Unrealistic, I should I mean. But that little grubber, that was... It's not even two of us a shack who did it, is it? I oh, know it is. Oh, I don't know. That was just... That was putrid. Putrid. I can't believe we conceded that. And Johnson, to convert the extras. Okay, he's hooking it around like... That never happens. Never happens in real life, let's be honest. Um, you don't get from that. Like, it's just not a natural curve. I don't care how much wind it is. About, like, unless it's like absolutely incredible like amount of winds. We're indoors anyways. How's that wind? Okay, I've noticed like... Chip and chases and shit are all pretty overpowered. Oh, he's dropped it. Dropped it. He dropped it. Go, 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 go. Holy shit, we've actually scored. Unless they give it a knock on, which there probably was. But we've actually scored there, which I can't believe. They give it a no try on the field. We get down on the line. What are they going to say? Try or no try. And they give it a try. Uh, pretty comical try there. I'm not going to lie. But we'll take it. It's about time we got some luck. Go our way. Especially after the first try with that little... Piss weak little grubber, and we've done our own little piss weak grubber. Too easy, Moses and buy it. Oh, Branko Lee. Branko Lee beats two of us a Shaq. This is a throwback to last year's two of us a Shaq, and Branko Lee is actually going to score. This is why he should be in the side in first grade because he can do this sort of stuff, create something out of nothing, just like he did there. And we scored actually a really, really nice try. Um, nine times out of ten, we don't beat, well, once beat the fullback, we do get caught. And I thought for a second he was going to get caught, but he had enough toe on him, and we do get to the line. This is a, a crucial try just for half time as well. And Moses kicks the goal from right in front. Oh, not supposed to go to him. Why would you not pass to Casiano? You know, the one making the actual run right there, right next to you. And there you have it. We've actually gone into the half with the lead. I think that might be the first time this series we've gone into the half time with the lead. So, pretty happy about that. Completions are quite good as well. Four from six. I'll take that every day of the week. Oh, that, that's a knock-on. That's a knock-on. He's literally thrown it into his own play. If it's not a knock-on, it's then an offside. We've been shafted there. Why did he get sucked in? I did not ask for him to make the tackle. I was literally trying to run back into position. And then they've went and scored straight off the back of that. I can't defend for shit. Not against two of us. Shek He's ripping us to pieces here. He's really, really... We're really struggling with him. This is probably the first back we've actually struggled to contain. Like, literally the triple whammy. There's a, there's a bloody knock-on. Followed up by a penalty which I didn't even, wasn't trying to do anyways. And then they go and score. Um, yeah, bloody brilliant. Back in the game, the Warriors. What the hell was that pass? That was ridiculous. That was shit. That was shit. David Clemmer. David Clemmer. Straight past to Shek. The turnstile. Oh, he's straight past that guy too. Oh, wow. What a run from David Clemmer. Tuvasa Shek, he's great with the ball. A bit of a turnstile defense. He is... 
Oh, yeah, we're going to run out of dummy half here with Josh Morris. We're just going to run it here, see what we can do. Actually, no, we're going to grub it to ourselves because that's quite effective. On this, there we go. There we score. I swear to God, the grubber is so overpowered. Any, the grubber, the chip kick, you literally, it, nine times out of ten, you're going to score from that. I've noticed watching all other people's YouTube videos and that. I just knew I had to give it a go. Maybe next time we'll do the chip and chase. Straight over, we got a six point lead again. This is probably the most points we've scored in a game, I think. So, either way, if we, even if we don't win this game, uh, good signs, I think. Oh, James Cram, straight from the kickoff, has been slaughtered. He's absolutely been slaughtered there. Oh, um, we've given a high tackle. A high tackle. That's not what we want. Or well, hopefully, they give it to the number eight there. I think it's the Lemon. Line him up. No. Nah. Not, oh, no, 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 don't you dare. Don't you dare. There's the animation. They just scored. Really? Right from the kickoff, they hit us with a with a big hit, and James Graham, of all people, drops the ball. Like, come on, man. I don't even need to bother. This is, it's a try. Back into the game. 18 all it's going to be. We have less than 10 minutes to go. They're going to have the ball. Hopefully, we can force an error ourselves here as Sean Johnson kicks the goal. Very, very frustrating. Straight through. Raymond for Tala Mariner. We can't get around. Uh, okay, that's going to be the last play. Yet the last play it takes bloody 40 seconds to um do the play the ball. Like, it's, the play the ball, they got to fix this. Okay, so we've gone into golden point. We'll be receiving the ball first. Um, I'm not nervous. Although last time we did play in this, we did lose. So, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this. Oh, um, we've been crunched there as if. As if. As if they're actually going to score from that. I cannot believe that. I cannot believe we've just lost. We've just lost off a big hit on this game. I actually hate... I despise this big hit. This is literally the worst part of the game. The intercept and stuff, you can cop that sometime. This big hit on pro difficulty. Ridiculous. So there you have it. We end up losing 22-18. to 18. Um, Our completion just weren't good enough in that second half. We just killed ourselves. Keep shooting ourselves in the foot. But oh, it's so annoying that we actually have lost that game. Considering we had the lead at halftime, we had the lead with 10 minutes to go and we still lost. We're 0 from 3 and 2 of those games we should have won. So looking at the other results, he Storm won, Titans won, Warriors obviously beat us, Rabbitohs won, Roosters won, Cowboys won, Tigers won, and the Dragons won. Alright, here we have it, the second game of the episode. We're playing at Lotto Land in round 4. It sounds weird saying Lotto Land, uh, but there have been some changes to the starting side. And you'll see in a second when it pops up on the screen. See Sam Casiano in its starting prop. We need to get him on. We've also added in Raymond Fatala Mariner into the starting second row there. That moves um, Aiden Tolman and Adam Elliott onto the bench. Um, they're actually pretty good players. I'm not going to lie, I like Tolman and that on the game. But I think Casigo and stuff, we just need to get off to a strong start. Try and blow off Manly. Just <laughs> blow off Manly. Uh, we need to blow them off the park straight away. See, so the team actually... It's okay. It's okay. Like, it's nothing spectacular. If we go 0-4 to start of the season, like we're in big trouble, and I'd probably get sacked, to be honest. All right, Branko. His dummy half runs are lethal, and he can't get around Tommy T. I thought we are going to get around Trebojevic. Hopefully, we don't pay from it. Oh, Marty Tapao. First tackle of the game for him, and he gets level, and he drops the ball. Oh, here we go. Uh-oh. Oh, thank God. I thought we were going over the sideline. Oh, and we have gone over the sideline eventually. James Graham straight through the gap. And we have no support. No support at all. Where the hell is Will Hopawati? And they, how the hell have they caught that? How the hell have they actually caught that? I cannot believe that. Why, why in this game do players not get drawn into... Uh, like, why can you not draw and pass in this game? I really... I don't understand. It's literally... Just one of the fundamentals of rugby league is drawing and passing, which you can't do in this game because the players don't get drawn in. They just hold off and hold off and hold off and then just intercept the ball. Oh, as if, as if he's just missed that tackle. The one time I don't control it because I think they're going to go further out. They do the inside pass. It's so obvious it's coming on. And Drake Dubojevic just goes through and palms him. Uh, we're never going to win in this game. 20 minutes in, Dylan Walker to convert the goal from essentially in front. And it's 6-0. Not the best start. It's a terrible start, actually. Oh, wow, that's not what I intended. But we nearly go straight through. Brett Morris. 
he beats two tackles. I didn't actually mean to throw the pass. I was actually just trying to change the Hopawati in defense. Oh, there we go. That's a nice bit of play. The the step just before the line, although usually they'd probably get smashed with a big hit and drop the ball. So probably why we don't do it too often. Just like that. Just like that. Exactly what I was talking about. Oh, we've got our own one. Advantage has surely been played. All right, that's going to be the end of the half. We're not going to another play. Because look how slow the friggin' play the ball is. The friggin' play the ball takes 40 seconds. Oh, my God. Wow. The play... <sighs> I don't know what to say about this game. And the half, that was a shit half from us too. 6 0 to Manly. What's our completion? 2 from 5. Absolutely atrocious. Yeah, we have more time and possession, which is funny, but uh, we, need some, we need to hold the ball. But to hold the ball, you got to get. Just hope that you don't get big hitted. And we just run straight past Lewis Brown. No, um, Syrian, which makes it even worse. We just like Curtis Syrian and make a line break against us. That's. No, nah, that's not on. That's not cool. I'm not cool with that. I am not cool. I'm pissed off now. How the hell have... Grubbers on this game! How? How? Our player was right there. Just pick the freaking ball up and run away. Dylan Walker from the sideline. They'll probably slot this one. They're going to start it out to the right and hook it around. Uh, not enough, you think? Oh, wow, they've actually kicked that. Such bullshit. That is bullshit. You don't hook it around that much. A few moments later. Oh, and we've kicked it into touch on the full. Oh, wow. 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 I cannot believe that. Just when I say to calm down, that bullshit happens. They actually get an offload, spread it out to the to the wingers and all that. Never works for me. Why does this shit never work for me? And then the computer does it on my team. Brett Morris missing tackles. Brett Buddy Morris missing tackles. Then Hopper, I can understand Hopper Whitey. He's a bit of a turnstile sometimes, but no, no, that's a no-no for Brett Morris. We're getting towed up on this game, and I feel this is not me being particularly that bad at this game. This is just the game being shit. You watch. Oh, the wind. Bringing it back around. Meanwhile, when I kick off, it's saying the wind's behind us. Yeah, great logic game. And a high tackle. Can things get any worse? Can things really get any worse for this team? Come on, over the sideline. We'll hop a wadi. You've finally done something, mate. All right, come on. Hop a wadi. This isn't a Sunday. You can do, well, maybe this is a Sunday, but it doesn't matter. You can do shit. Well, how are you supposed to make a line break or something without cheesing? Fuck this game. Make the... Hey, where's, where's the freaking... Where's the intercept for us right there? And how they didn't score right then is actually, like, ridiculous. And watch, they're going to score right now. They score right there. And Dylan Walker kicks the goal. And we're losing 24 0. There we go. We've actually benefited from the AI being completely retarded in this game. They've just blown a chance there. And they've just grubbed it for no reason. Literally, no reason at all. Grub it to ourselves. Let's grub her again. Uh, no, we can't grub her again. It doesn't work for us this time. But there you go. There's another point. Uh, just trying to prove the grubber is completely broken on this game as well. Another thing to add to the list of broken things. I'm just complaining. I'm just going on full rant mode this, this game. Well, that's full time. Thank God that's over because I was literally about to break my PlayStation. Maybe snap a disc or something. I don't know. 24 nil that game. I couldn't do a thing. To four walk at Trebojevic. Cross our scored tries. And you saw quite a few of them. I'm a bit bullshit, those tries. Their completions were near perfection. Ours four from eight. Well, we may as well check out the results for the last game and see we're dead last at the moment. We haven't won a game. Roosters, Panthers, Broncos, Seagulls, Sharks, Cowboys, Storm, and the Warriors won. Take a look at the ladder. You can see we're in last. Um, every other team has won a game. We obviously can't at the moment. I've, I've got to change something. I don't know what to do, though. Anyway, guys, that is the end of the video. Hopefully you enjoyed that a little bit more than I did. <laughs> it's a bit of a ranty sort of episode. Uh, but if you did happen to enjoy it, make sure you go ahead and, go ahead and uh, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. It's at MrLukeNYT. My Facebook page is in the description below. And I'll see you for the next episode. Bye, guys.